Welcome back friends. In this video, I'll show you how you can install MSY H2 uh, C compiler in your uh, Windows machine. Using this, you can uh, able to run C or C++ programs uh, directly through command line or through any of your ID like Visual Studio Code, etc. So without any delay, let's get started. So open any of your browsers and search for msys2 it will redirect you to the official home page of this compiler for both 32 and 64 bits are available in executable format i have a 64 bit machine so i downloaded it 64 bit version now click click on that executable file click on next you can choose the installation directory also but i let it as it is and click on next you can see the installation process has started here now after installation we'll be back now the installation has finished click on finish button and it will open a console like this this is the console window or command line window through which we will uh, configure our compiler or download some components which are needed to install the original compiler now uh, I increase the fonts of these text files so that you can clearly visit clearly see what is happening here yes we are okay done now type these commands pacman hyphen syu look pacman i have misspelled so correct the spelling of pacman and hit enter you can see the process has started here it will download some required files through the server the process will depend upon your internet connection speed so make sure you have active fast internet connection to overcome the delay now it's asking for the installation process now type y and hit enter installation process has started it's a little bit longer process so be patient now type the command pacman hyphen su it will asking for the installation process it will download total 41 MB of data and after installation it will be 255 MB so type Y and hit enter the download process has started Second step is over and go for the third command. Now type the command pacman hyphen ss space gcc. It will list out uh, available all the available gcc compilers. You can choose according to your machine and your requirement. I'll download this this version 9.3.0 gcc compiler. 64 bit so copy the name of the compiler and paste it over here to download it type pacman hyphen su and name of the compiler
it will ask for installation so type y it will download total 58 mb of data and after installation it become 428 megabytes We can check the installed GCC version. So to check that, type GCC hyphen V. You can see here the GCC version. Now the downloaded completed. Now I'll show you how you can check it through the com command line. showing this error because we have not uh, set the path yet so to set the path go to the installed folder now go to the bin folder and copy the path and paste it under system variables environmental variable on right click on this PC icon and go to properties now click on advanced system settings and under the environmental variables and system variables click on path and paste that bin bin path over here now we set with all the working functionalities of GCC MinGW compiler. So that's all. In the next video, I'll show you how you can integrate it with VS Studio.